My name is Dan. I'm a director of marketing in the financial software industry, and my rating for Drift is 5 out of 5. So when we looked at our marketing strategy, one of the gaps we realized that we had was that we could drive leads through forms, but there's a significant portion of our traffic that was hitting the website and not converting through any mechanism that we had. Uh, after we researched to see ways that we could fill that gap, live chat emerged as a good option uh, for us to try to go after some of the traffic that was hitting the site and not converting. One of the first things that drew us to Drift was actually their thought leadership in the marketing space. We liked the way that they thought about engaging with prospects. Uh, we liked their mindset and methodology for capturing and nurturing contacts and leads, which is what led us to, to Drift initially. As we met with their team and did demos of their product, what we realized is that they had a very robust tool with lots of options um, that allowed marketing teams to deliver customized experiences through chat on the website. So some of the key features that drew us to Drift um, were around the, the bots and the automation workflows and the lead routing options that they had, which allowed us to involve multiple members of our team, um, but also still distribute chats evenly um, so, that not, so that one person wasn't just dominating kind of the overall volume. The other big feature that I liked about Drift was the fact that uh, they had an app um, so that our team could manage chats uh, from while they were on the go through the mobile device as well. The onboarding process with Drift was really straightforward and easy. Um, setting things up and deploying the tags um, was all very well documented and straightforward. Um, the, the work really came through um, implementing and executing Drift well. So, you know, obviously it takes time to, to build good workflows and build playbooks and deploy and test them. Um, so I'd say that the front end experience of onboarding with Drift and then implementing Drift was very, very straightforward. Um, and you know, while the the setup in terms of playbooks and everything was easy, it was just you know it takes time to, to do that well. So that's not a bad thing, and it can obviously be tailored to the complexity that you want um, when you deploy chat. So we overall the process was was great for us. So I would say the main considerations for anybody that evaluating Drift to think about really is just how um, how well the Drift platform integrates with their existing marketing stack. Drift has lots of great integrations, so I just suggest that people make sure that they uh, compare and make sure that the integrations they want are available with Drift. Um, I would say the other big piece of advice is just to build relationships with your customer success manager. Uh, Drift employs great people who know how to leverage live chat really well. So make sure that uh, you, know, you leverage the technology, but also leverage the people that are there to make sure that you get off to a really good start and, and continue to optimize based on their learnings from both your account and the other accounts that they work on.